Good morning and happy Tuesday. Today is day three of our self-care challenge and today's focus is on intellectual self-care. So intellectual self-care is doing something that you enjoy that also nourishes your mind and challenges you mentally. So for me, I personally like reading. I read every day for 10 minutes. I started that at the beginning of the year. Now I'm on book 11 and I am currently reading The Three Secrets of Effective Time Investment by Elizabeth Grace Saunders. So I love that it's talking about time investment and not time management. But anyhow, I'm learning some great things from this book. Um, and yeah, I'm just a huge fan. So for you, what are you doing today? And if you don't know, I have some options for you. And of course, remember these are not limited. You can choose other things that are not on the list. But of course, reading, like I just in indicated, you can take a course to learn something new, some new information, a new skill, something like that, a new language. You can watch inform informative shows. My dad loves informative shows. I am not a fan. <laughs> you can complete puzzles, either physically or technologically, like on your phone or on your computer. Maybe go to a museum. So those are just a few options that you can take on to practice intellectual self-care. But just make sure that you are, you know, stimulating your mind, that you're learning, that you're being mentally challenged. And so, so many different options that you can do. Even participating in intellectually stimulating conversations can help. So what are you going to do today for intellectual self-care? Make sure you comment below. And if it's not exactly intellectual self-care, but it is a form of self-care, don't be shy. You can still um, comment below because I want us to practice self-care every single day, no matter what kind of self-care it is. So thank you so much for tuning in. I look forward to reading your responses and I'll see you next time. Bye.